It's your boy James Davis, and we're gonna make a hood adjacent turkey sandwich. Now it's a hood adjacent turkey sandwich because it's gonna be simple, but with a little bit of fancy on it when you least expect it. I can take my turkey sandwich onto the golf course, or say you're kicking somebody out the house. Get out of my house, but here's a turkey sandwich, because I'm not evil. I usually get my onion pre-cut at the grocery store, because I'm not a fan of knives. Onions tend to make me cry, but I'm gonna keep it gangster. White bread, I mean, does it taste good? Absolutely. But wheat bread helps your bowel movement. And a slice, who needs that? We don't need end slices anymore. We got TV shows coming out. I like to triple up on my protein. One, another one, another one. Three of them turkey things. I'm gonna put some onion in there because I need a little bit of uh, extra credit in there. I like flavor coming from all directions. Gotta have some good butter lettuce. Once again, for the bowel movement. I've eaten a lot of bullshit in my life. At this point in my career, I'm trying to put the goodness in there to counteract all the Skittles, blunts, and whatever I do at Coachella every year. Tomatoes, once again, gotta get my OJ tool. Just one thick piece. Boom, we're done. I like to have burger energy with my turkey sandwich. It's piling up like a Flintstone sandwich, but I'm gonna mush that thing down. Now we're gonna put the mayonnaise on. Adjacent, the hood doesn't mess with mayonnaise like that, but James does. James loves a little mayonnaise. What is this, Dijon mustard? Well done. I don't want that regular hot dog mustard. We're fancy. I'm staying at the Bowery, okay? I'm living life. I need that Dijon. Mustard that's almost empty, where you have to do this, and you have to like kind of put your chest muscle into it and get the rest out, and then it starts to get a little clear because it's a little old too. That's hood mustard. Now we're gonna put a little bit of salt. Just a little bit though, because we're adjacent. The hood loves salt. That's why the hood has a lot of high blood pressure issues. I just want to do this, but I can't afford that much salt, so I'm gonna do it outside of my sandwich. Then we're gonna put a little pepper, and guess what? I'm trying to get more swole, so mo turkey. Now, my sandwich is complete. Saucy and juicy up top, dry on the bottom, and I always like to give a shout out to my mom, so I'm gonna cut it from the way my mom cuts the sandwich, diagonal. And there you have it. You got your dry turkey, you got the saucy turkey, and then you can see the salad. It's almost like there's a salad in the middle of the sandwich, so you can see the healthiness going on. This is called the Hood of Jason, because it looks simple, but then you peel this back and there's a lot of nuance in here. It's not just a normal turkey sandwich. If you're in the hood, you gotta be solid. You can't get pushed around, because you gotta stay dangerous. This is a solid sandwich. You could drop this, you could kick it. It could fall out your car, you pick it up, it's still intact. I didn't want you guys to see the beast. Oh yeah. You see that? I've been into this thing like an inmate who's been on the run for days and it's still standing tall. Feel free to steal my recipe. Everybody, enjoy yourself a hood adjacent turkey sandwich. Look how sturdy it is. Stay dangerous.